hey guys welcome back again so the last part of this series is that whenever we click on this uh, profile icon here we should be having our camera app open and then we can take an image from that camera app and then what will happen that that image gets uploaded to our firebase uh, storage and then whenever the user opens this activity that is uh, if we go back to here that is inside our notes app and if you go inside this activity that is the profile activity the image should be automatically downloaded into this image view so let's see how do we do that so firstly what we want to do we want to uh, create an on-click listener on this image view here so here inside our android studio we have this image view and let's go to the xml file here and here on this image view i would like to set an on-click listener so on click and here I'll say handle image click uh, like this and then we'll create this method inside our profile activity and here inside this handle image click what we would like to do is that we would like to start our activity take an image from the camera app so here what I'm going to do I'm going to build an intent so intent intent equal to new intent and this would be media store dot action image capture like this and if you don't know how to take images you can watch my video that is linked above and then we want to resolve this intent that is intent dot resolve activity and get package manager should not be equal to null if it is not equal to null then we would start the activity for result so start activity for activity for result and here we would like to pass in our intent that we have created and the second parameter is the request code so here i'll provide take image code and let's copy this thing from here and let's set this image code at the very top of our activity here that is inside the profile activity it should be an integer take image code should be equal to something unique inside this activity and here i am providing 10001 like this and now what we want to do we want to handle this image capture inside the on activity result method so let's overwrite that method that is on activity result like this and then we'll check if the request code is equal to our take photo code or the take image code and if it is or uh, here it should be equal equal to not equal to but equal equal to and let me increase the font size and now we'll switch the result code that is switch result code and here case result ok and if the result is ok then we can get the bitmap from this data that we are getting here that is this data so bitmap bitmap equal to data dot get extras dot get and here we will pass in data like this and now we need to cast it as a bitmap and now what we want to do we want to set this image inside our circular image view so here we have this profile image view dot set image bitmap and here we would pass in the bitmap that we have just created and then what we want to do we want to upload this bitmap to our server <laughs> that is the firebase storage so here i'll again call another method that is handle upload like this and here we would pass in this bitmap that is this bitmap and here i'll create this method here that is below the activity result and it should be a private void handle upload and this should be called bitmap like this and now we can start the upload method here that is uploading this bitmap to our firebase server or the firebase storage so here what we need to do we need to get the byte array output stream so byte array output stream equal to new byte array output stream like this and then bitmap dot compress and the format would be jpeg and the quality would be 100 percent because the bitmap we are passing here is a thumbnail of the actual image because this data intent contains only the thumbnail image and not the actual image so that is why we are providing in the quality to be 100 percent and the third parameter would be the byte array output stream so byte array output stream and where exactly we would like to 
upload this image to we would like to upload it inside the profile images folder inside the root folder that is here we are inside the root folder and here we should be having a folder called profile images and inside that folder we would like to store this image so let's create that storage reference so storage reference reference equal to firebase storage dot get instance dot get reference dot child child would be the uh, folder name so profile images and then the final child or the actual path or the actual name of the image would be something plus dot jpeg and here what this something means is the actual image name how do we want to name our images we would like to name our images as user id dot jpeg because each individual user or each authenticated user has a unique uid so we would like to name our image like uid dot jpeg and where can we get the uid from so it is very simple so let's say string uid equal to firebase auth dot get u instance dot get current user dot get uid like this and here we would pass in that uid that is uid plus jpeg and now to this reference we would upload this bitmap so reference dot put bytes and bytes we can get from this byte array output stream so byte array output stream to byte array dot add on success listener new on success listener and we want to also attach the failure listener so dot add failure listener new on failure listener and now here what you would like to do you would like to log the exception so loggy e dot get cause and now inside the success block what we want to do we want to get the download url of this image that is the image with this reference that is this reference so what we can do we can create another method here that is private void get download url like this and this would take one parameter that is the storage reference and this should be called reference like this and here what we can do inside the success block we can call this method here that is get download url and here we would like to pass in this reference that is this reference that is the reference of the image we have uploaded so we can pass in this that is the reference of the image and here inside this get download url what we can do we can simply call reference dot get download url dot add on success listener new on success listener and we are not attaching the failure listener here and here what we can do we can simply log the uri here so log d on success plus uh, uri like this and now when we get the uri here that is the download url of the profile image we would like to set this profile image url inside the user object that is the currently authenticated user so here what we can do we can call another method here that is private void set uh, user profile url and this takes in one parameter that is the uri that we just got and this would be uri and now we can call this method that is the set user profile url so let's call this method from here so set user profile url and here we would like to pass in the uri that, that we just got here that is inside the on success block and now here what we want to do firstly we want to get the user so firebase uh, let's call it firebase user and this should be user equal to firebase auth dot get instance dot get current user like this and now what we want to do we want to make a change request to this user profile so user profile change request it should be request and it should be new user profile change request dot builder and here what we want to do we want to set the photo uri like this and the uri would be this uri that we just got and then we simply call build and now what we want to do we want to get this user dot update profile and here we pass in this request object and then we can add the success listener so new on success listener and similarly we would like to attach the failure listener so add on failure listener so new new on failure listener inside the on failure block what we would like to do let's may simply make a toast here so toast profile image failed let it be something like this and then inside the success block what we would like to do let's uh, make a toast again and let's say this time updated 
successfully like this and now let's run this application and let's see if we are able to upload this image inside the user profile so let's run this application again and let's open the firebase storage here let me go to the profile activity now let me click here now we are inside our camera app okay so now let me click a picture here now let me click on check here we have this image here and sometime later we will be seeing this that upload successful updated successfully so now let's refresh this page here and let's go to files again just to refresh it so here we have the profile images folder and now inside this profile images we have this image with the user id and the extension is jpeg and now if you open this file here we can see the current image of the user which he has or she has uploaded so this is how you upload your profile images and now let's go back and now let's again go back here we see that this image remains the same but we are not seeing the actual user profile image here so what we need to do let's go to our application again uh, here inside the on create method where we have got our user here that is the firebase auth.getinstant.get current user here we are showing the display name inside this edit text and here let's make one more if check that is if and here let's check if get photo url not phone number but photo url is not equal to null then what we would like to have we would like to download that image into this uh, image view so for that we'll be using a library called glide so let's quickly install that library so let's go to google chrome let's search for glide glide library let's go here and here let's copy this dependency from here with the annotation pro processor let's go to android studio let's go to the build.gradle file and here let me paste it and let's click on sync now now let's go to profile activity again and let it sync let it sync the syncing has been finished and now inside here what we can do we can use our glide library so glide dot with context would be this dot load uri would be user dot get photo url like this into image view and the image view is the profile image view so that's it so let's run it again and let's see if we can get the profile image as soon as we open the profile activity so now let's go to the profile activity and yes we have our image there but i clicked it so i came to this screen here so now let me take another picture and let's update it again let's click the checkbox here we have the new image and we see that we are we have updated the profile image successfully now let's go back and let's try going back again and here we have the newly updated image and here inside the firebase storage we see that we only have the single image we don't have two images but rather we have a single image because we have rewritten that file with the same id with the, with the same name and that is the reason i have used this uid here just to make sure that every user should have a single profile image so guys that's all about this video so if you have liked the video do hit the like button and if you haven't subscribed to our channel do subscribe to my channel and if you want you can support me on patreon.com i'll provide a link in the description below so thank you bye bye tata take care and have a good day